my enemy angel night. What's up, baby? Happy birthday. Happy birthday. What? Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Who? Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Hey. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Ow. <laughs> happy birthday, Gemini. What's going on, my babies? Are y'all balancing yourselves? Are y'all behaving yourselves? Do I need to get the bill? Because, you know, I told y'all, we're going to start bringing the bills to the reading, okay? Welcome to Mocha Love Tarot. If this is your first time viewing my channel, hey, how you doing, boo? I'm Mocha. Also, if this is your first time viewing my channel, because a little bit or not a bit. Just depends on what the hell I see in these cards, okay? I love y'all very, very, very much. To those who like, share, and subscribe to my videos, thank you very much. I appreciate you very, very much from the bottom of my heart. From the bottom of my heart. Okay, <laughs> and for those new subscribers, welcome to the family, babes. I hate long intros, so we're gonna get into it. This is for the sun, moon, rising sign, and Venus, and the cross watchers of Gemini. Okay, honey. Oh God, honey. Gemini. Let's get it. Um, intuitively, Gemini, I feel that a lot of y'all just simply need to speak your piece. I feel that. A lot of y'all know what you want. You've already made your decision on who you want to choose. You've already you already know that whoever whomever you're dealing with, whomever you're trying to move forward, that they're your soulmate. For some of you, they're twin flames. For some of you, they're soulmates. For some of you, they're karmics. And honestly, I feel like some of y'all are so caught in the whole trying to figure out who the hell it is that you miss. You're gonna ultimately miss the opportunity. But some of y'all of a lifetime. And some of y'all is due to y'all being stuck with people who you know you're not supposed to be with, okay? So with that said, that's for whom it resonates with. Please come in and let me know for the tea because I pour it back. You understand? But we're going to get into it. Get your life. It's who I'm, who, whoever I'm talking to. Get your life, okay? And I can say that because we family. Let's get it. All right? So this is for... Gemini's, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Cross Watchers for the time frame of June the 1st. Ooh, shoot. It's to the 15th. Spirit, Angels, Holy Ones, Most High God. Please give me the message. For Gemini, June 1st to the 15th. What can they expect? June the 1st. To the 15th, but the sun will rise this night. Venus, the cross watchers, Gemini, from the 1st of June to the 15th, or the sun will rise this night of Gemini. All right, Gemini. It's funny that I asked that and I told y'all what I told y'all intuitively. All right. Let's go. Gemini. From June the 1st to the 15th, I feel like some of y'all are dealing with a controlling earth sign. Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus. I feel like some of y'all are, some of y'all, okay, are secretly in your heart of hearts by the 1st of June. Some of y'all are going to reach the point where you want to leave. Some of y'all are dealing with a Sagittarius as well. Um, but I feel like some of y'all want to leave. Some of y'all are in mental conflict, kind of in mental bondage. I feel this is internal or mental bondage uh, because ultimately some of y'all have a Taurus. A uh, new Taurus that came into your life, or that you will be meeting between the first and the fifteenth of June, and some of y'all, this is gonna be, this is gonna pertain with this Taurus. This is gonna pertain to those of you who are leaving Sagittarius or who are leaving Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, like yourself. I feel like if you're dealing with an air sign, this air sign has you all in your head. I feel like you want, you want 
a new start. You want a new beginning. You want a fresh start with this air sign, possibly someone from your past. However, this person, every time you let them into your life, they do some sneaky, deceitful shit, okay? So, so ultimately, I feel like some of y'all are hanging around, and some of y'all are really, really, really in your head, and a lot of y'all are needing balance, okay? Some of y'all are juggling earth and air, and some of y'all are juggling earth and a water sign from your past. I feel like this water sign from your past, some of y'all are in y'all head about this water sign also from the past, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. I feel like... For some of y'all, this person has done something deceitful to you in the past, and you want to move forward with this person. I feel like some of y'all, this person, if it's a water sign, is coming to you telling you, hey, I've changed. I've got balance. I've gotten this. I've gotten that. Some of y'all want to hold on to the idea of this person. However, you all, you, you, y'all want to hold on. I feel like Gemini, y'all are wanting to hold on to the idea of a person. And some of y'all, y'all actually holding on to a person who is very sneaky and deceitful, and if this is not this person, this is you. But I'm going to be the first to tell you that in June, from June the 1st to the 15th, some of y'all are going to receive messages. Or some of y'all, this person is just going to straight up tell you, or you're going to tell this person, I'm unhappy. I'm ready to deal. Some of y'all, when y'all say this shit, this person is going to hold on. Some of y'all are avoiding making a decision regarding the earth sign that y'all just met or trying to move on to and a water sign from your past. Some of y'all are having a decision making between an earth sign and an air sign. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Some of y'all got a sneaky Sagittarius that possibly will be leaving y'all or in their head about leaving you or this could be you. Some of y'all are communicating very childish or someone is very communicating very childishly with you i feel like this is going to be some of y'all could be getting a message also from a fire sign possibly the sagittarius but it could be aries leo as well but this is somebody who left you out in the cold before i feel like for some of y'all this could be the father or the mother of your children i feel like some of them are going to be moving forward towards you to bring your life balance, okay? This is somebody who juggled in the past. This is somebody who y'all had deceptive shit going on in the past. This person could be offering you a new start, a new beginning, and you like, hell no. <laughs> and hell no went to hell, hell no, okay? So um, <laughs> I feel like, Gemini, this is going to be a month of strategic, strategic planning. I feel like this is going to be a month of... You being in your damn head when you shouldn't be because if a person has shown you who they are, truly believe them, Gemini. I feel like some of y'all are holding on to situations. Some of y'all are holding on to y'all. The divine is, for some of y'all, the divine is calling y'all to hold on to y'all money because some of y'all just out just splurging and spending, not knowing if an emergency hits or if something off guard hit your ass, you're not going to be ready because some of y'all are just being very impulsive with your money. Some of y'all are holding on to y'all money too tight. Some of y'all are holding on to a relationship. I, some some of y'all are holding on to a relationship where somebody else is providing for you or somebody, y'all holding on to a person or a job. This could be a job too. That's not fulfilling. However, you holding on to it with all of your damn might when you have other decisions to be made, I feel like some of y'all are moving in, y'all trying to move in comfort. But the comfort that you know is knocking you off balance. And for some of y'all, y'all taking L's behind this. And for some of y'all, a person who's standing in your way, okay, since you couldn't do it in the month of June, the divine gonna do it for you. Period. Because some of y'all are lacking balance. And it's having to do with control. Somebody in this relationship is controlling. It could be this earth sign. If you're dealing with an older, or, or like you've been dealing with an earth sign, not the new one, an old one. I feel like you're trying to hold on to somebody from your past. That's the earth sign. I feel like they're coming in offering you this new beginning, even though you know they're deceitful as hell. Or this is somebody who you deceive and you in your head about it. Like, is this going to balance me out? Is our hell going to be breaking loose like it did in the past? Is this person going to leave me high and dry like you could have left them in the past, Gemini, or vice versa? This is going to be a hell of a decision-making month for Gemini. And some of y'all are going to juggle. Some of y'all are going to juggle two people. Let me clarify. Let me clarify the outcome. In the first... 
June to the 15th for the summer wrap. So June the 15th. Sorry, y'all. Some of y'all, some of y'all could be going into a new beginning with water signs. Some of y'all could actually have a water sign possibly trying to offer you a financial start. This could be a boss. This could be a friend. A water sign is going to help y'all. I feel like if you're dealing with a water sign and you have children with this person, there's been a there's been an issue with reciprocity. One person is giving more than the other. I feel like that situation is going to balance itself out in the month of June 2015 from the 1st to the 15th, 2015. The month of June from the 1st to the 15th. Y'all, what the hell? I feel for some of y'all, this earth sign is coming to y'all like this, I mean, a Capricorn, Vir Vir Virgo, Taurus. This person could be younger than you. And because they're younger than you, some of y'all in y'all head about the rec receptivity and reciprocity. Will it be me giving, 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 giving? Because some of y'all are just assuming the worst. First and foremost, get out of that poverty-ass mindset. If you assume the worst, you're going to get the worst. Okay? Don't assume the worst. This person is being genuine with you. They're younger than you, but they are going to come with equal give and take. Because you've been hanging around with a motherfucker who just take, 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 take from you. Some of y'all got receiving issues. Some of y'all need to learn how to receive. For real, for real. Okay? So for the month of June, from the 1st to the 15th, make a decision, Gemini. I mean, like, for real, for real. And don't be holding on to shit just because you're comfortable with it and it makes you unhappy. If you're unhappy, be true to your damn self. If the realness, being real starts with you. Okay? You can't be real with nobody else if you can't be real with you. And that's just 100. Look at the bottom of this. Oh, King of Pentacles. Yes, for some of y'all... Earth sign, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus. Strong emphasis on this damn Capricorn. But it could be a Taurus. Because I got the higher for him. Could be a Taurus. Y'all got these, this Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn offering y'all a new beginning. Some of y'all could be dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn already. And you like, oh, hell no. Like some of y'all, this person just told you what they sign was. And you was like, uh, hell no. No, back the hell up. Stop. Okay, <laughs> stop. Because this one here is a good one. He's coming to bring you balance. He's coming to bring you. He's coming to allow you to receive. Okay? That don't mean that they're going to be around forever. It just simply means that you're getting a new beginning to get you out of this set, to get you out of this bullshit. Okay? This could simply be a catalyst because I don't see any soulmate cards. I'm going to be very honest with you. All right? But take your damn get out of jail free papers and run. Okay? Take it and run. Run fast. Put your quickest Nikes on, sis, bro, and run like hell. Okay? Run towards these coins. What's wrong with you? Do I need to get the belt? I got the belt on y'all ass. Don't make me get the belt. Okay? This is not a personal. This is general. This is what I have for my Gemini's from the 1st to the 15th of June. Y'all know I'm coming with wedding haters at for June. Y'all know I'm coming with them real ass randoms. So I'll be checking in and I'm going to do my mid-month. So I will be checking in quarterly for y'all asses but make a decision Gemini get out of your head out of your head first okay write that shit down if you have to write down the pros and cons to this shit real shit it helps me writing down stuff helps me a, a grant okay because it, it's reflective it gives you time it gives you it gives you the opportunity to actually see it see it before you on paper and it came from you so you know it's genuine. It came from how you genuinely feel. Write how this person best supports you. Write the shit that you don't like. If the good outweighs the bad, work on it. Make a decision, okay? But if the bad outweigh the good, what the hell are you waiting on? Run fast to the catalyst. Run fast to whoever this is that's offering this beginning because it's time for you to receive. I'm talking to people who give, 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 give. Why can't you get sometimes? Don't be in your head about receiving. Who does that? A crazy person. That's who. Stop it. I'm going to get the bill. I love y'all. <laughs>
<laughs> need a personal reading. That information gonna be in the description box. But until then, get out, get your ass off your head and on your fucking feet, okay? I love y'all, babies. Catch me on the flip side. Mmm. <laughs> Bye, booze.